Hey guys, I'm trying something new in creating my first Paladin's Guide. These are four useful tips that will help you become a better player. Let's get right into it. I'll start with the most important tip. Be aware of your surroundings, or as I like to call it, having game sense. Be aware of what champions are on the enemy team. Remember to ask yourself, is the Androxus on the enemy team trying to pick off your backline? Always keep in mind how many players are on both, alive on both teams. If your team is taking a 4v5, it's best to play passive while your teammates ride back from spawn. But if a fight's 5v4, it's time to get aggressive and push into the enemy. The second tip is about your ultimates. Saving your ult for point fights is great, but what if it's needed to guarantee a push or defense? When to ult is completely up to you, but using it when it could reasonably make a difference is pertinent. However, feel free to use your ultimate if you have enough time to rebuild your charge before the next round. Each roll builds ult charge at different rates. Tanks gain ult charge the slowest while DPS or support will generate ult at a much faster rate. So if you use your ult with a minute thir and 30 seconds left in the round while playing as a tank, you should have enough time to regain your ult charge before the next round. Whereas other classes could ult with one minute left in the round, output either enough damage or healing and regain their ult charge. Use your game sense and the in-game timer to decide when to ult at the right moment. And now for the third tip don't let your role define you. A lot of newer players make the mistake of not playing the role to its fullest potential. Even though you're playing as a tank, your job isn't just to rush straight to the point. You can use your high survivability to control the map and push into the enemy team. Supports can also use their high sustain to outtrade a DPS in the early game before they have much cauterize. Also keep in mind in Droxus players you don't have to try to 1v5 every fight. Use your game sense to choose your fights. The fourth tip is about casual. Casual is your mode to mess around and experiment with new things. If you understand every champion in Paladins, it will give you a better understanding of the game and improve your overall game sense. Knowing what a champion is capable of gives you an idea of what to expect before the game even begins. Playing a wide variety of characters is also a good way to prevent burnout. Remember, no player is perfect, and discovering new builds slash playstyles in Casual is a great way for you to learn and improve. Don't forget that you can use the import button from the deck creation screen to see what builds pro players are using. This was a short guide, but it might be the first of many. If you found this video useful, please leave a like and tell me what you would like to see next in the comments section below. Don't forget, I have videos for every champion on my channel and I stream Paladins daily on my Twitch. Links to my stream and my loadouts can be found in the description. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon to be notified when I release a new video. Thanks for watching.